everybody and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World the game. New dinosaurs, new hybrids and battles of course to look at dear. So today let's start by hatching all of these Mosasaurus and bears. Ooh, hold on. That looked cool. I haven't seen the Mosasaur in that sort of exhibit in ages. Oh, look at it. Oh, he looks so cool. Does it? You know what? This Mosasaur, it doesn't look like the one from the movies. But you know what? I'm okay with it. It doesn't look as rugged. It looks more thin, streamlined, and I don't know. Which one do you prefer? Hmm. I don't know. I like both of them. They're both pretty cool. They're both pretty neat. So I have about 40 minutes um, to uh, quickly do something that is so good. Oh my god, if you never saw this, I feel sorry for you, because this is one of the best things that's happened in the game for a long time, and it's not collecting all of that, but I'll do that anyway. No! We're gonna fuse this first, and no, it's not that either! Oh, what are you waiting for? Maybe it's in the thumbnail. Maybe it's in the title. I don't know. But here you go. Level 21, uh, Arctodus. Which is the... It used to be a rare, and now look at him. Now look at him. He's a level 30 bear with 1,933 attack and... Like, nine... Sorry, health and 900 attack, is it? And he can catch fish. 580 attack, 1,933 health. Wow. I bought a bunch of these because this creature, or this mammal, this... Uh, what would you call it? Um... Mega fauna? Is it? Would you call it mega fauna? Is it still a mega fauna when it's not a mammoth? <laughs> Either way, this mammal. Um, we'll just collect all of that. A hundred bucks as well. Wow, nine thousand. Uh, it used to be rare, and it got updated to a tournament creature. So it's definitely going to have a hybrid at some point. Um, but no, what we are looking for is not one hundred fifty-nine dollars straight in dollar pro cocoptodon uh, pack. No, it is none of these. None of these that actually cost money. No, it's not this either. Fidelity pack. It is in here. 40 minutes. 75 million coin for a legendary pack. Are you kidding me? This is so good. I mean, apart from the fact that you don't get, you know, anything except for food. But you do have a chance at getting... Uh, well, you have a chance of getting a legendary hybrid, but you have a 100% guaranteed chance to get a legendary. It kind of brings begs the question, remember when you used to be able to trade coins in the trade harbor for legendary creatures? Yeah, but now we can buy a pack. Actually, I thought this was better because I thought it was a regular legendary pack, as in you could get uh, like DNA and food from it. In fact, I mean, it does say legendary and then has a DNA symbol in the pack, but that just means that you can get a legendary hybrid. I thought it was... Uh, anyway, either way, this pack only cost us coin. And we got a Pteranodon from it, as well as thousands of food. I mean, the food, you can kind of get in the trade harbor. Oh, really? On a hundred? Ah, oh, they nerfed it. I thought it, it deliberately made a specific pack for that. Damn. Is there anything different in these ones? Anything extra you can get? Because that's a regular mystery pack. Um, but it, it just looks like it's a buddy pack now, because of Easter. Um, is there anything else I was going to do before we get... Oh, hold on, I think there was something here. Yeah, oh, <gasps> I don't have that coin! Oh, no! Oh, oh, yeah, there's no way for me to get coin either. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, God, so sorry, guys. <laughs> uh, but we do have 30 minutes to get a Battle Build-Up Golden Rewards Pack. It seems too good to be true, doesn't it? That's probably because it almost looks like it is. We're gonna do this with only Zalmoxies. Actually, no, we're not. We need 2,000 odd health. That's what we're gonna do with. We're gonna do it with Stegoceratops. Go on, go for, go for two straight off the bat. Go on, I dare you. Oh, nice. I'm gonna live. Uh, I can't kill him. I'm gonna have to go for two block and one reserve. Hopefully, because I'm on such low health, he'll just go for two attack again. Ah, oh, goes for one. But this time I have four. Do I risk the biscuit or go for it? I could kill him. But. Actually, I don't even know if I could. I'm gonna go for three block, one reserve. Aha! Perfect! Woo! Patience is, uh, it's paying off. And there you go. There's the win. 
Done and done. That was actually really hard. We've got to do four of these battles within half an hour to get a legendary pack. A proper one. Not one of these cheapy ones that only has food and 100 VIP points. And a le oh, leg the legendary is a good trade. I will admit that. Ooh, a level 80 Dominus. Ooh. Can a level 30 Dominus kill it? Whoa! Level 80 versus level 30. Is it doable? We're going to go for one block right off the bat. Can we do it? Can we do it? Oh. Oh, is it doable? Oh, no. This is tricky. Please say he went for a block. And we have not lost, technically. Not technically. We might have. Oh, oh, keep on going. Oh, we're going to do it. I think we're going to do it. Go for four, please. Go for four. Come on. Yes. Have we done it? I think we've done it. Oh, my God. Right. One, two, three. Oh, we just did it. Oh, my God. That was so close. Yes. Who needs a level lady when you got that? Oh my god, that was... Whew, that was close. Okay, a pterosaur. Oh, 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 You didn't say it was a pitiful Suchopterus. Oh, I can do it. I can do it with this guy. Easy peasy. Against the dragon. Scapo boobly boobly bap. Against the dragon. It's easy peasy. Watch. Oh, that's good. That's good. Could have. It could have went either way there. Could have died. But he went for all blocks, and that's okay. That's decent. I'll take that. Oh no! Oops! I did the wrong way around. I meant to do two block, one reserve. Oh, it worked though. <laughs> Should we go for it? No, it's he's too risky. We'll go for that. We'll go for that. There we go. Right. If he goes for four now, we've definitely killed him. Come on, come on. Can we do it? Pro plays, big brain plays. Oh no, I don't know, man, I don't know. How much damage do we do? Okay, if he blocks one, we've lost. <gasps> yes! Now that's what I'm talking about. Wow! Jesus, we're making this look like a walk in the park. Oh, Uyops, a very easy one to take out as well because it's such low attack. Um, it's health, pretty decent. But I think something like Diplosuchus has got this in the bag. Easy peasy. Not even going to go for a block. I don't think he can kill me in two hits. I didn't think so. Okay, so one, two, and one block. Sorry, one reserve. Just in case he did go for two more reserves. I definitely can't survive three. That's for sure. Ooh. Ooh. Well, another two and another two. Oh, that's not so good. E4. I think we can still survive this, though. I'm pretty sure. Oh, okay. So one block. Uh, can we kill him in five? Of course we can kill him in five. Yeah, look at that. Dead. Boom. Easy, easy, peasy, squeezy. There you go, there's an easy peasy squeeze. <laughs> easy, <laughs> can't even talk. The easy peasy squeezy song. <laughs> you thought my singing days were over. Bring on the ballads. <laughs> oh, level 84. Ooh, ooh. Well, looks like we're gonna have to bring in an Indoraptor and a Pritrodon. Actually, I'll tell you what, if you start with Pritrodon, we'll start with Pritrodon, and then an Indoraptor, and then an Indoraptor, because <laughs> why not? We've got them. We've got a million Indoraptors. Just defrost one. Take it out of the freezer. We'll have it for tea. The Indoraptor that came for tea. Why has nobody made that crossover yet? Instead of Tiger came for tea, the Indoraptor came for tea. It'd be way better. It'd be one page. It'd actually, it'd be a two page spread. It'd be like, Indoraptor came for tea, Indoraptor left, and then it would just be everybody dead. There you go. Right, we're gonna have to go for three block because we can. Ooh, you can kill us in two. So that's the minimum you'll have to go for. Oh, well, you're the biggest threat. So if you don't mind, die. Oh, wow, you didn't go for anything. Okay. It's still gonna be a thousand. One, two, three. Ooh, ooh, he's gonna go for three and kill me and have three left to block. Wow, okay. But look at the attack! 4,000 almost! 
Woohoo! Four block! I mean, four reserve. Ha <laughs> ha! You wasted! <laughs> you fool! Right, so he's gonna have to go for three to kill me. Minimum. Oh, now he has to go for two minimum. Oh, and he doesn't go for anything. Well, you're dead. One, two, three. You're dead. Factor in two, because that's playing it safe. And he only went for one! Ram! We've done it. Bagged ourselves two, technically, legendary packs. Already. And we're fucked. Sorry, I just felt like doing that. <laughs> it looked, it looked, it worked okay. Interrupted it the rar, and I did the and it worked okay. Mm, seven. Let's go for it. Yes. And he's dead. There you go. <gasps> it's like a fish. Bam. A shark fin. Done and done. Gold rewards collected, and they're a pile of garbage, except for the exclusive sticker and the VIP points. 650. Now, 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 I see that Ludia are starting to do this. Have you seen it, guys? Have you seen this? They have put a new pack, only for VIPs, the Pagoda God. Um, so, yeah, that's a thing. Great. I mean, you get 100 bucks. However, I can spend half the amount and still get the same bucks. So if it's books you're after, no. But if you're after a limited uh, pagoda, that is it any good? What it, does it doesn't say what it? I mean, oh, it's a building. Oh, I thought it was a decoration. Who cares about buildings? Sorry, but who's spending VIP points on buildings? Rather, I mean, I, yeah, I mean the greenhouse is the same, right? That's a building. Four thousand. The sundial. And it's a, so, is it, uh, but what's the, I mean, you get 10% for a four radius, right? How much does a fountain give you? Fountain gives you 10% for a three radius tile, but it's kind of okay. And a John Hammond uh, gives you 7% for a six radius tile. So I guess maybe there's an argument to be made, right? John Hammond can reach there in a six. So, the argument to be made is, can a four reach that? Can a four reach that? So, it's four tiles, right? So, one, two, three, four, right? And what is a fountain? Is a fountain three, a three tile radius? One, two, possibly, possibly a four radius tile can do that. I'm, I'm kind of curious now. This is a six radius, so one, two. No, I don't think it can. That's a six, right? Five, four. No, it can't reach it. It can't reach it. So no, it's not even good if it was a deck, like a sundial decoration. And I think a sundial is pretty big anyway. Either way, either way, we've got these things quickly to get done because we need to get some, uh, yeah, I only need one, how are we? <laughs> I don't need any more, are you kidding me? We're gonna now we don't need coin technically we do because we're low on it But we could only have bought one of those legendary packs, but the reason we're doing this is um, So we can get one step closer to break. No, no, it's a one step closer to the edge. I'm about to break. That's it. There we go <laughs> We get one step closer to unlocking the clash of the Titans. Not only that Do that one as well. Yep. No needed. Uh-huh. Not only that, but we're getting VIP points for it. That's the point of it. I'd love if there was some way to see how many packs I'd opened, how many battles I'd done. Like, if I could see a data sheet from my account, that would be amazing. I'm sure they must do that, right? Or maybe they just wipe it. I don't know. There'd be a lot of data to keep. Like, how much DNA, DNA I've collected? How many dinosaurs I've bought? How many battles I've done? How many packs I've opened? That'd be amazing. I'd love that. Uh, do I want to waste that? I don't think so. I think, I think Nundagosaurus has got it. Yeah, pretty much easy. Don't need to waste. I mean, that level 20 Diplosuchus or Diplosarcosuchus here, it's really good. I could maybe even use it for some high level battles. If it was level 40, definitely. Right, uh, I think that's you done. Yep, there we go. Boom, two, bam. How many packs can we open? Set world record here, coins. Yes. And 130 VIP points, which I'm not going to shake a stick at. And whoops, we're over halfway and we've got 14 days left to get Benogamous. I love that they've put Clash of Titans in. That's a really good uh, thing to put in. A really good idea. 
bit too many battles because the battles are really tough, but uh, what can you do? So, do we go for the no restriction? It's a whiteout and try our Arcodus. Where even is he? Oh, that's right. Oh no, he's still pretty high. Damn, dude, we need to put him in. We need to put Arcodus in. Let's put Arcodus in. Right, okay, so this is a really good battle. Everything's got half attack, basically. If it looks like the last material, a thousand attack, it's really only 500 and 33? Yeah, 33? Kind of 0.5? Either way, uh, all we need is some, uh, some of those. So he can't kill Thalus Melis in one hit, which is good. And then Arctodus can come in. And then, I mean, there's nothing really. Ah, oh, damn. Because we've got to do four battles of this. I think... Oh, no, his health's really low, actually. It's only 1,900. We do have another Arcodus, though. Is it possible to do that? Oh, my God. That is really... Oh, do I put... I'm going to put it just for safety. You know what? Sod it. I'd rather win this battle and use a Smithoceros than lose it and use my Arcodus. Yeah. Okay. 900. That's a load of attack. I forgot about that. Wow. Jeez, that's, that's like on par with Arctodus. That shows just how good VIP creatures are, man. Almost a level... Well, a level 30 tournament creature. It's the same, except for the health. Uh, so he did go for an attack, didn't he? I'm pretty sure he did. Um, yeah, he did go for one. Well, he went for one. He didn't go for two, unfortunately. Um, okay, and we may as well just go for three reserves, because we pretty much won this. I don't know if we play a risky. I could have went for three block, but I'm okay. Whoa, he goes for four, and that is game, set, match, and one. Oh, what? Arcadonis has got even less. Wow. Okay, so one, two, three, you're dead. Um, we, what's his attack? Like 450-ish. Um, I think we can definitely take two hits. So I'm going to go for that. We can definitely take two hits. I don't know if we can take another one. Possibly could take a third hit. Possibly could take a third hit. But it, we would be left with like 100 health. Oh, okay. That's uh, one block. So one, two, three, factor in one, and then two reserves. Now, could we have done it um, with a level 10 Arctodus left? Now, we'd only have had 300 attack. Oh, we could have done it. Yeah, because then I would have just went all out like that. We could have done it. We could have done it. But you know what? Sometimes better to be safe than sorry. Bear! Man, bear! Oh, bears are so cute. I love bears. I mean, not if they're attacking my face, but I do like the way they look. So, here we go. You want Savannah. That's what you want. Because the best, they don't have a counter for it. Right. So, same tactic here. Ooh, let's start with something there. Enter Lakabakos. Do that, then Gastornus, and then Indraceris to clean up, just in case. Uh, we can't die in one hit, so may as well reserve. Even when they do switch in the Indracotherium. Is it Indracotherium that they switch in? It is Indracotherium. Indracotherium. Oh, it's been a long time. Do you remember when it was in Dressport Builders? Do you remember that, that fossil of a game? And you had blue spots with yellow trim. Oh. Uh, the days, the glory days. Oh, God. I remember back then being able to schedule a week's worth of content in a day. Oh, not in a day, but I would basically have it recorded in a day. God. That was crazy. Okay. And I may as well go for it and just get him out of the way. So that 1,200 attack gets turned into 500. Oh, oh my God, that thing looks horrendous. One, two, three. He's going to go for six. <laughs> Fall for my trap. Oh. Yes. Kiwibird. Were you Kiwibird or was that Phosphoracus? I think it was Phosphoracus. I think you were like Doombird or something. I don't know what you were. But uh, I'll go for one extra because I think you have a block. Yes. Voila. And brings in Titanaboa. What? <laughs> that animation sped up looks so damn. Oh, he's got like a tiny head. Look at him. Right, let's go for a full-on eight attack and see this one sped up. Karate kick! <laughs> Straight through the block. Beautiful. Oh, there we go. Another 50 DNA. Good 
God, do we need it? Uh, what's this one? Ooh, 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 not bad, actually. That's, that's, we could probably do the Easter battle event and get a sequencing pack. Is that worth it? Because we only do the prize wheel with this one. Oh, God, it's, okay. Okay, who's the biggest threat here? Who's the biggest threat? Ooh, probably the Mega Sotherium. Maybe. Hmm. What's he weak to? He's weak to Savannah. Uh, oh god, we're going- And then- Okay, this is what happens. He switches into Mega Uh I, I've went for a block, so I survive. And then when Mythotherus dies, uh, Mammothurium kills him and then puts him in. Then... Um... Ooh, ooh, then his perfect counter comes in the Thalacus Malus. Oh, that's horrendous. Okay. Um, and then we need another good... We need another good planes like Mastodon. That's what we need. Ooh, this is tough. Oh, it's a shame that lineup's really bad for me. Oh, God. Okay. Um, right. Let's try it. This I'm not 100% sure of. Really not 100% sure of. I need to go for one block to survive, or else I die in the first turn. Ooh. Yep, there it is. There's the death. And he didn't go for it either. Okay, okay. So, I could do two things here. I could go for two reserves and possibly survive, or I could go for two block and possibly survive. There's no way I'm guaranteed. So, I'm just going to go for that. I'm going to go for that. Oh, we could have survived. We could have survived. It's a shame that he kills me in one hit. Oh, hold on. We've won, I think. Yep. There you go. Oh, from the brink. From the brink. That, that, we could have lost this. Okay. Now that we've saved you, we can uh, switch in uh, you. Because, oh God, then he has the perfect counter, which is fine. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take the perfect counter. Oh! He only went for one block. Like, I only factored in one block and he went for it. Woo, aren't you a pretty kitty? Stripey kitty. Right, go for six. You can definitely do it. Yep, there we go. And we won. Whoa! Right, it all depends on the next battle, how tough this one is. So one, two. Uh, actually, yeah, that, that's fine. Yeah. We pretty much won this one, guaranteed. It's it's just what that last one is, because I don't have the greatest of creatures. And if he has a lot of counters to cavern, like a lot of planes. Oh, I don't know. Hopefully he's just got a lot of... Actually, no. He needs Savannahs. Savannah to beat me. Hopefully he has a lot of planes. Hopefully he has a lot of planes. Come on, please have a lot of planes. Oh, yes. Ah. And there you go. Right, this is it. This is it. Please, a lot of planes, and don't be savannas, and... Oh, there's, there's two planes. I'm happy with that. Two planes. Right. Okay. And the plane, the savannah that he does have, doesn't have the greatest of attack. Uh, even doubled. Okay, so we need something with lots of health just to tank. Tank first. Then, if things go bad, I'll save Hyena Dawn for last. Oh, this is it! For all the marbles, here we go! Right, just tank it. I'm just going to go for one reserve straight off the bat because I can tank it. Look at that. Not even level 40. This thing was a silver or a rare. I can't remember what it was, but it was not as good as this. Woo! For all of you guys that did invest in the glaciers before they got updated, wow, you, it's, it's paying off. <laughs> and you, what you could do is sell all of them and get a good positive DNA. A good positive righteous DNA investment when you sell them. But, uh, if you don't have them, well, there you go. I bought as much as I could without speeding them up and spending money on bugs. Or, like, spending books at all. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Is it worth it? Mm. I might as well try. Or should I? I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm going to keep on going for loads of blocks. I want him to spend all of his turns wasting his, his goes. I want, I want to see a six come out. That's what I want to see. Okay. If he's only happy spending an eight, I'll do that. I'll do that. Because Titanobo has way more attack. And so does Hyena Don. Seven. Spend a seven. Do it. Oh, he's killed us. But that's good. That's good. He's only got one. Actually, no. He doesn't have any block. 
Yeah, he killed me, bud. Here we go. <gasps> Super fast snakey snake. Right. One, two, three, four. Kills him. Two block, two reserves. Battle one. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, there we go. Can't kill me in two. And definitely dead in two. So we can go for six if we wanted to. Make sure. Make sure. Making sure he's dead. So one, two. Three, four, and then two reserves, because he's probably only went for, yeah, two block, and he only went for one, and there you go. Next one has even less attack. <laughs> Synthesaurus, our poor little Starbucks. So, you could probably kill me, and you probably will. And he goes for six. Oh, good on you, Starbucks. In comes Hyenodon. Ready to rip you apart. There you go, six, and dead. Wow. There you go. Easy peasy. Oh. Looks terrifying. Oh, have we just clocked over? No, we couldn't have. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? What are we going to get? So, damn. Well, you know what? That'll do. 17 and finally 60 minutes left to do this one. Oh, but I need to do this. Oh, there's so much to do. I love this game. So much to do. I don't know. I think maybe they updated this game to have these uh, code 19s whenever. Like, it used to be three or four a day. I feel like I did five yesterday. Because I was rec I was uh, playing this in bed. Um, and I was getting loads. I, I was thinking maybe they've updated that to make... Because with Jurassic World Alive, they've made it so, you know, you can play it more often. Even if you don't go outside because of the whole quarantining that's going on at the moment. Um, and I feel as though maybe they've done that the same with this game. Maybe they've put in stuff that allow you to... Uh, keep on playing the game, like doing code 19s all the time. Without waiting a day. Okay, here we go. For all the marbles! There you go. Well, we missed one, so we could have got even... We could have got way more DNA, but 390, I'll take as well as 10 of that. Okay, we've got 50 minutes, guys. 50 flipping minutes. Indoraptor, go in! Kill him! Uh, and Glyphornax, why not? Yeah, I don't need any more. It's pretty much one. What attack! Kill it! We go! <laughs> Interrupt and we'll kill the ball. Come on then, go on then. You think you're hard? You think you're tough? Oh my god, I woke up early today. I woke up early. Yet this time yesterday, I was just having breakfast. Wow! And I've done two videos. I'm impressed with myself. Oh, it's a good feeling, baby. Right, and go on then, Pachyrhinosaurus. See what you can do. What's that? Nothing! Cause you're dead in one hit! Boom! There you go. That's not the fastest battle you've ever seen. Oh my god, you only got 10 for- What? 10? Okay, it's time for another Indoraptor, but not as good this time. Because it's really not needed. And a Baryonyx. Oh no! But- Oh, I didn't mean to select that. I meant to click- I clicked go, and then went to click ready, because I was expecting it to say, Are you sure? And I clicked Mastered on a Swords. Damn. Oh well. Who cares? We can maybe we can even do the uh, the battle stage infinite battle. Let's go for it. Let's just finish him. Ooh, he could have survived one hit, but chose to be a fool. And Enosaurus comes in. All right, let's just kill him because he dies in one hit. And we are. Another fast battle. There you go. Boom, another 10 DNA. And the final one is... Oh, wow, it's terrible. Oh, well, tell you what. Actually, that level 145 Caprasuchus poses a little bit of a threat. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I see your game. I see your game. Uh, let's go. I would use Mastodonosaurus now, but I've accidentally already used it. Do I have anything else? Um, I mean, something... Elephasaurus is pretty decent. Yeah, and... May yeah, yeah, I guess? It's not too bad. I may as well just go for one hit and take off almost all his health. Yeah, there you go. Might as well do that. I mean, worst case scenario, he switches. And does a hit of like a thousand damage, and that's it. Oh! You're a fraud! You should die to me! You're a Bonogamous hybrid! You should be weak to me! That should be a little easter egg. It should be like a hidden weakness that uh, Al Alo Alogamous is weak to flies but doesn't show it. That would be really cool. So we'll go for that because we only need one hit to kill him and... I think Caprasuchus could kill me. 
Um, but Roger Steger would easily kill him anyway. Oh, there you go. Is he going to go for two? Oh, he goes for two. Gets the kill, Rage. In comes Roger Steger, the improved Rage, and kills him in two hits. Wallop. That's it. Wow, we did so much. We've completely cleared these entire event events, I should say. And actually, we're about to get, uh, in a couple of days, another chance to get Tyrannosaurus Rex Gen 2. I don't know how anybody's managed to unlock Indominus Rex Gen 2. I don't know how you've done it. If you have, well, you must have spent money on those packs. You must have. So there you go, 1,500 DNA, as well as 130 VIP points. I'll take that. And a little bit closer to Clash of the Titans. We were on 14, and now we're on 18. Yeah, look, Gen 2 Fury. <gasps> okay, and then it's just the tournament. But we also have the Battle Stage Infinite to do, uh, which is only one battle. And it's tough. It's, it's really tough. That's the worst combo. Oh, that sucks. Parasaura is just... Actually, it's a Metricanthosaurus, a Metrorancus, which is posing the problem. Because I could just go for an Indoraptor. But that Metricanthosaurus? Oh, you ass! Okay, okay, here's the plan. Here's the plan. So, we're going to put in a Carnival, like Erlophosaurus, as bait to switch in the Metriancus. Then, then, Segnosuchus will come in and kill Metriancus. Metarancus. And after that, Rage will come in. Rage may kill me, but there's a chance that Segna Sutures can kill Metarancus in two hits minimum, which is really good. So we might be able to survive the first hit from Raja Steger. If we do, then we can just put all our reserves into Segna Sutures for Indoraptor to come in and sweep. In fact, is it worth it? Ooh, that's putting you down. The attack's a little bit more, but it's the health. And that's what I'm worried about. We could be killed in two hits from Roger Steger with Indoraptor. But Udon can survive two hits. And that's the play. That's the play. Here we go. Let's do it. So, right off the bat, we're going to go for one reserve. Because Roger Steger can't come in two hits and Metrorancus can't come in one hit. That's the play. Oh! Oh! Didn't expect this! Didn't expect it to stay in! Oh! Oh! This is actually... Not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, okay. Okay, you know what? You know what? Sod it. Four reserves. Here we go. To the wind. Okay, he can kill me now. He can kill me in three. Hopefully he does. Oh, he doesn't. Right, this was easier than I expected. So one, two, and then three reserves. Just in case he went for a block. Ah, there you go. Perfect. There you go. Beaver's pro tip forever for this game. Always factor in two block. So three four, five. He will go for five. All of his goes to kill me. Segna Suchus comes in. We didn't even need you, Don. Oh my god. Again, another thing you could do to really help people out, Ludia, is if a creature is not used, then it gets saved. And that way, it builds more strategy. So, it, you know, if it's not used, then you save it, and you save bucks, and you can use it again. So players will be more likely to, you know, go for blocks. I could have survived that, if I knew, and if I wanted to, if I knew that Udon was going to be able to be used in another battle right after. But because I know he's not going to be able to be used, be <laughs> lots of words, uh, I might as well just go for all out, all out reserves. And, oh, what a team! They, 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 they're, they're so, those colors look great together, those two dinosaurs. And there you go, Udon takes it. So we get 100 bucks as well as a normal... Extra DNA pack, common. Oh, 150 bucks! I'll take it. And what's the uh, VIP points? 65. Okay, 65. Not bad. And in eight minutes, we'll have the Quetzal. But you know what? I'm okay. We've done this for half an hour. We've done all of the flipping battles. Actually, let's have a look. Missions. What do we have? Oh, look at it. Yes! All of the super DNA. <gasps> so close, so close to another Interruptor. And then technically we could get a level 40 Interruptor, but I'm not going to do that because it's not worth it. Don't do it. Do not get level 40 Interruptor. It's not worth it. Just get loads of level 20s. I'd say 10s, but level 20s is actually really good. Maybe even level 10s. You know what? Sod it. 
Don't listen to me. Do what you want. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, uh, bye-bye. Oh, also, uh, sorry. Click on the news tab and do this. This is a really good way to ensure that uh, you get the dinosaurs you want or creatures. Which creature would you like to see in the next Clash of the Titans? Um, huh. Probably Darwin Opterus, because Darwin Opterus is, uh, is much better, I would say. But that's just me. And, you know, you get 250 free DNA. Also, link in the description down below. Collect your in-game books. I think it's 50, is it? Something like that. But anyway, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. I'll see you later. Love you. Bye.